Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to really briefly cover the difference between microeconomics and macroeconomics. With that said, let's get into things. So starting off with microeconomics, micro deals with decision making at the individual level. We would study how households and individual firms such as Nike or Google make economic decisions about their consumption and production. Macroeconomics, on the other hand, looks at the nationwide or economy-wide phenomena like unemployment, interest rates, inflation, and aggregate or economy-wide output and demand. Both fields of economics rely on the use of models to help explain or to predict economic outcomes. Models can explain how an economy works. They can also be used to predict what would happen in a market or an entire economy if some sort of economic factor has changed. Remember, economics is a social science, and essentially, economists try to model human behavior, which is a very complex thing to try to predict accurately in any discipline, let alone economics. We have to make assumptions about how consumers and firms react to changes in order to keep our models simple enough to tell us something meaningful. These aren't wild assumptions, they're based on a theory. A good model will give good predictions and policymakers can use that to implement sound economic policies. There's many topics in both micro and macroeconomics. If you're studying the subject, then feel free to check out our other videos as we have plenty of content for you to look through and hopefully this will help you throughout your studies. If you enjoyed the video, let us know by liking the video, subscribing to the channel and comment what sort of economic topics and or homework questions you'd like to see us cover in the future. Thanks for watching this video and we'll catch you in the next.